Hey there, I'm meteorologist Amanda Cox in the Fox 46 Neighborhood Storm Watch Center. It looks like we're going to keep mostly cloudy skies around throughout the overnight hours and temperatures are going to remain on the mild side. Upper 40s, lower 50s for many locations. There may be a few places that hold in the middle 50s, so not a bad start to your Sunday. But we do expect to have a little bit of fog around overnight and into tomorrow morning. That could cause some reduced visibility, so just keep that in mind if you're going to be heading out early on Sunday. But I do think the fog should taper off pretty quickly. The clouds, though, are going to hang on for the second half of the weekend. There could be a shower, too, that pops up, but that's not going to hinder our temperatures at all. Mid to upper 70s for your Sunday afternoon. We could even see a few breaks of sunshine later in the day on Sunday, but it's not going to be a lot, and those clouds are going to thicken up as a cold front approaches our area. That front is going to bring in some rain late Sunday night during the day on Monday, but the good news is it doesn't stick around for very long. And then as we get later Monday, Monday night, it looks like it's going to push off to the east of us and we'll start to dry out, which is going to set us up for a great day on Tuesday. Rainfall chances look to be pretty high on Monday with that front coming through. We dry out briefly for your Tuesday before another storm system comes in on Wednesday and then again at the end of the week. Here's a look at your extended forecast. Temperatures are going to hit 77 for your Sunday afternoon. Then we're going to drop to 65 on Monday due to the fact that that rain, those clouds, clouds are going to be around and behind the front we're going to go to 54 on Tuesday despite a good amount of sunshine across the region. Don't worry though the temperatures will be right back into the upper 50s and lower 60s for the second half of the work week. I'm meteorologist Amanda Cox. Have a great night.